Hi everybody, I'm Philip Duncan. Thanks for joining us for our Tuesday weather video brought to you by Country TV on Sky Channel 081. Well, we've got a busy set of weather still with us and we've got more coming from Australia later in the week and this coming weekend. Here's the uh, satellite map taken on Tuesday. The next front, very clearly visible there, zipping on in from the Tasman Sea. There'll be a burst of rain in particular for the North Island later into Tuesday and across Tuesday night, Wednesday morning. Then across Wednesday, these are the heavy showers that are coming in. Once again, a lot of them are coming in for the North Island's western side. There could be some hail, some squally showers, and maybe even the odd isolated rumble of thunder. So this is how it looks when we switch on those wind and rain maps. You can see Wednesday, pretty uh, messy once again. All the wet weather is mostly focused on the North Island's west coast. There will be some around the South Island's western coastline and around Southland as well, but it's cold and you might see a bit of snow up in the hills as a result of that. This is a cold southerly sweeping out there, but it's slightly warmer nor'wester for Wednesday, but once these uh, big showers start to come in, you will feel the temperature dropping once again as the showers see a southwest change. And into Thursday, and you've still got those showers coming through, they're not quite as heavy by the end of the day as they were over Wednesday. They're gradually becoming fewer and far between, and by the end of Thursday, hopefully uh, becoming mainly dry as this low that's been with us really since the end of last week finally starts to move away. But I just want to end on one last note because this weekend we've got another big low coming in. There's a transition day here Friday, but see this low, small, doesn't look like much. But when I zip to Friday, look at that, it just instantly explodes into the Tasman Sea. So this is one to watch across the weekend. It's not necessarily going to drive in a lot of severe weather, but it does drive in more windy weather, more isolated downpours, maybe some thunderstorms as well. So we'll update you again in more detail, obviously, tomorrow. And don't forget, for the 10 minute long 10 day forecast where we talk all about what's going on this weekend with that low, you can go to Sky Channel 081 Country TV.